right, well, here hey, we are. Hey, how's it going, everybody? Welcome back to Game Guys. Okay, so, Dad, last time we left off, we defeated Yorm the Giant. Uh, we got summoned right in front of an old woman. So now what we're going to do is we have to get back to the old lady. So, Dad, go down those stairs. Yep, yep, down these stairs. We are making our way back to the old woman. Pick up your green ball. Yep. We already, we already made yeah, a... Yeah, 1,400. Oh, oh. That... Yep. Is it, is it there now? Bring up, no, no, no. Bring up the elevator. You have to bring up the elevator. Where, where do I bring it up? There's a, there are levers on the left side, but take out the enemy first. All right. Excellent. All right, Dad. Now, go to the other side. Oh, See okay, that lever right there? I need you to... Yes. Excellent. I was in here before, because I remember having to jump down. Oh, doing more, uh, just test practice runs? No, 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 no. I just remember it from, from the last game, right? Or, oh, or right, Earlier yes. in this game? Earlier in this game, right? Go forward. I'm sorry, could you repeat the question, please, Dad? I, I, I... Hold on. Wow, good. I thought I, I was like, oh shit! I because I, I hit that other that other dead knight, and I was like, I hope I wasn't. I hope I didn't wake that up. So am I going through here then? You're going forward, yes. No, I was just saying. Sorry, because I was trying to concentrate on the fight. I was just saying I, I recognize this, but I just don't recognize if I was here in this game or in the earlier game. Not this lo not this exact location. And Orlando, yes. We were just at Enerlando not too long ago. That was a location from the first game. Oh, this seven. location was is unique to this game. Am I going down here? Not that way, no. You're gonna go take a right. You're gonna go down this main hallway, or down the main, I don't know, stair pathway. You're gonna take a left up it. And you're okay. going to fight the knights along the way. Okay, Dad. You've got this. It's a guy with a shield. Now you see... Actually, I'm gonna say this. These tower shield fucks are such a pain in the ass to fight. They block most of your attacks. You gotta go to an attack. And then when you just, when, just when you think you get a... Okay, you've aggroed the second guy. Focus tower shield guy, because he's like basically one direct hit away from death. Shit, I can't. Come on, Kevin. You might want to back up and heal. I'm trying to. Jeez. Low health. I know, I'm trying to get... Alright, shield guy's down. Okay. Yep. Alright, Dad. That Excellent job. That was fucking job. ugly. That was fucking ugly. All right. I'm going to say, so one thing I've noticed about your footwork when it comes to these fights, Dad, is that when you're when you're dodge rolling like that, I understand sometimes, no, turn around, we're going upstairs. Okay, well, I just, well, well let me move while you're talking so we can. Okay. Oh, didn't I just come out of here or not? I... We're getting ready for the next boss fight. So stop for a minute here. Okay. All right. Couple things. Number one, when you're dodge rolling, you don't always have to be doing a dodge roll. Like if enemies are surrounding you and you're getting cornered and you need to like just get out of there, yes, panic dodge roll. I was, yeah, I was in that particular fight. I just, I was out of sync. 
I was just out of okay. sync. That, that's why. I really, I really wasn't, I wasn't meaning to, I wouldn't have dodge rolled as much. I was trying to get away from them. And then as soon as I started to drink, they would hit me and I would, I would try to roll away because there were two of them. So that, that, I would like to say that that last fight was, was ugly and not indicative of, of my, of, of where I really am in general at this point. I, I, I didn't feel like I ever really got my, got my bearings in that fight against those two. So if that helps, I mean, I, I, I'm, I'm not, I'm, I'm not, I'm not arguing with you. I, I, I'm just saying, I don't think that that was a, that was a, a, a good, a good. I understand. So. It's a bit. Just having right, an so update. And then I'm going on way too much about that. So okay. What, what, the, so this boss. next boss fight coming up. This is called the, uh, this is the dancer. It's this long slender lady. It's a, it's another giant slender type of creature. It's, it's a, it's a woman dancer type. She's got two glowy blade weapons. And it's just going to be, an, it's like, like most bosses in, as we're playing Dark Souls, you're just gonna have to get the attack patterns to attack patterns down. Okay. okay. So here's what we're gonna so do. We're gonna talk to the old woman. She's gonna just die on her own after we exhaust her dialogue. So go ahead and talk to her. The dancer will show up, and then you will fight the dancer. Prince Lothric is in your hands. Please save his soul. Tell him what he must be. So, so far you've got three of the four. So let's... Give it a moment. Go forward. Oh, okay, I, I guess I needed to... Yeah, you needed to get closer. Okay, so it doesn't immediately start. You actually have to go forward a bit. Okay. I actually didn't know that. I thought it just immediately got started. Maybe it's because I just always went forward. So it just seems like it always immediately started. So yeah, like I said, tall, slender lady something. Does she have a big a reach, like a good reach? Yes. Like, probably, yes, right? She's got, she's got some decent... She'll... She has, like, a spinning attack that can hit you multiple times. That's, like, the one attack to be aware of. What the... Oh, well. That's the brother. You're that. alive. You're still alive. Don't panic. Don't panic. I mean, definitely get out of there, get some space, and heal. All right, excellent. That was a risky heal, but it worked out. Oh, boy. Shit. This, I believe, Didn't kills survive you. that one. Okay, so I need to avoid. Is this is this is this a better two-handed battle? Maybe. Yes. Let's try two-handed. So that I can just dodge and. Yeah, right, I would so... say at this point we're at the late game bosses, so you're better off just two-handing your Uchigatana and just going with dodge strat. Block strat, and also your health pool is so big and massive at this point that you're better off just taking the occasional hit while improving your dodge strat rather than trying to get better with block strat because blocking becomes less and less valuable as we get to the uh, the is towards the end late game. I'm going to send this back up till I forgot to do that last time. Yep. That's something you can do. Nope. Just, that, just go just forward. Just go forward. Just, just, into the tunnel. Just, just down the stairs. Keep going forward. We're just going to run straight back to the boss. 
right? Right through here, right? Nope, 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 nope. Left. Yep, down this way. We'll take a left up the main pathway, run past everyone, and cross through the fog wall. That's where the dancer fight is. Yeah, those fucking Ninja Turtles just praying. Alright. Dancer time. Oh shit, I... That was... That was very sus. That was a very sus hitbox. But you are very low on health. Two-handed. Dad, you're two-handing your shield. Press Y. There you go. Lock onto the boss will help. Yep. Yet. I need to figure out what that move is. How? How? Or do I just need to hit and then just back out and not sit there? So, when so the I boss raises his her. right arm, when the boss right. raises his right arm and kind of pauses for a brief moment, he's Get getting she's getting ready for the grab move. So okay. if you see her raise her right arm, be ready for the grab move. Okay. All right. All right. So down these stairs, hard left. Drop down. I'm going to be very quick with the instructions. Just to, at least just to get back to the boss fight. Yeah, okay, yep. Once when, once you're at the bottom, take, send the elevator back up. Good job dodging the knights. Alright, Dad. Alright, you gotta dance off now. So that was just a quick attack. She'll pause for a bit when she's gonna do. Yep, so, yep. There was the brief pause. You might wanna back up and heal, you're halfway. You can survive one grab attack if you're at most health. Yeah, go ahead and heal. Shit! Low health. Oh, nice. Missed out on a prime attack of opportunity when she missed her grab move. Low health. Ooh, that was really risky. Low health. You're still good to engage. Grab move. Nice attack, attack. All right, back up and heal. Good job. Back up and heal your little help. All right, phase two, she draws her second sword. Yeah, do not get hit by this. Wow, nice. You dodged through like three intervals of that attack. That was actually really good dodging on your part. But well, your low health, please. Please don't die here. Shit! I was drinking and she hit me twice. So, we made it to her second phase. She draws her second sword. And I'm actually glad she started with that attack, because that's that that is the com that is the spinny combo attack I was talking about earlier. Okay. And, okay, well that's, that's and good to you know. dodged and like three potential hits of that attack. Because it's a multi-strike attack that she does. Shit, I didn't, put, I didn't send it back Yeah, you, you, you missed it. Remember how much grief these guys used to give you? Shit, well, I yeah, meant I would, to... 
I was I was gonna say take a drink. No, I wasn't. I didn't mean to take a drink. I. But I just want to point out, like, look how much more durable you are compared to when you started. I just always love seeing like the resource bars just increasing in size. Older games used to do this. Newer games still do this. But I'm noticing more and more it's all about just numbers and percentages. But right. the bar stays the same size. Like, that's boring. Yeah. I want to see the increase. Like, it just looks cool. Getting close enough to her. Yeah, take a drink here. Oh, nice. You dodged the grab move. That, you probably would have survived that too, even at your current health state. Oh, yeah. Face your dad. Get out of there. Ooh. You didn't quite dodge as many this time around. Well, when I was behind it, it felt like if when I was behind her, I was I was okay. It was when I was trying to dodge away she from She was that. drawing her second weapon, and her character model was kind of obscuring that from where your camera angle was, because I didn't see it until she started doing her whirlwind attack. I didn't again. You did what again? Oh, it is up there. I thought that I couldn't. I couldn't see the elevator. The elevator was there. That's. I was. I was wondering what you were looking for. All right. Well, Ready? I'm like Bono. I still haven't found it. You've sent it up now. Remember for the next attempt, if you have to make a next attempt. Okay, come on, let's get this check. Let's get the girl! Okay, let's dodge Spear Chucker first here. Come on! Alright, let's, let's get her. Alright, Dad, you got this. Alright. Ah, uh, Dancer of the Burial Valley. Fun fact, when we first met the old woman early on in the game, if you kill that NPC, you automatically spawn this exact boss fight. Could you imagine it spawning this boss fight at the low level when we first met her? Yeah, I don't think that would have been fun. You, the boss would have one-shot you. You have had to have a perfect boss fight, no hits. Or you get an NPC to just soak the hits for you get an NPC summon for the boss fight. That was some explosive diarrhea. Jack! 
it. Ooh. You I got the heal off. Just... You got the heal off just in time, though. Like, frame perfect heal, Dad. But, but you do want to, yeah. You do want to follow it up afterwards. Okay, yeah. So when the when that mist comes up, the dancer is run her second blade. Not bad. You only got hit once, I believe. Oh, nice dodging. Excellent job, guys. Yep, that's a little AoE splash. Low stamina. Low stamina. Low health. Low stamina. Shit. Towards the end, your issue. You were, you were not managing your stamina well that time. You were like at little to no stamina, much longer than you needed to be. Yeah, I know, I know. And then what I happened know. was, well, you got hit a couple times. Now you're low health and you're low stamina, but you need to dodge the next incoming attack. You have no stamina to dodge, or you barely dodge it, but you can't dodge the follow up, and you just can't get the heal off. Sorry, right, Dad, you'll get this. All right. I felt I was doing better there, and then and then I just, I kind of lost my timing a little bit. And I think I was trying to run up to her, and I was trying to think, don't press the B button too hard. Oh, shit. Kevin. All right, Dad, next attempt. I believe in you. All right, Dad, here you go. Just got to lock on. Nice dodge of the grab move. Excellent. Stamina management was good that time. Alpha slow. Oh shit! Dodged right into that one. Yeah, that was unfortunate. Shit! You might survive this. You have a sliver of health, you're still good. But you need to heal as soon as you get up. Like, mash that heal button. I did. 